today, March 15th, we celebrate the feast day of Saint Louise de Marillac. Born in France, Louise lost her mother when she was still a child, her beloved father when she was 15. Her desire to become a nun was discouraged by her confessor and a marriage was arranged. One son was born of this union, but Louise soon found herself nursing her beloved husband through a long illness that finally led to his death. Louise was fortunate to have a wise and sympathetic counsellor, Francis de Sales, but from an interior illumination, she understood that she was to undertake a great work under the guidance of another person she had not yet met. This was the holy priest, Vincent, later to be known as St. Vincent de Paul. At first, he was reluctant to be her confessor, busy as he was with his confraternities of charity. Only over a long period of time, as Vincent de Paul became more acquainted with Louise, did he come to realise that she was the answer to his prayers. She was intelligent, self-effacing and had physical strength and endurance that bellied her continuing feeble health. The missions he sent her on eventually led to four simple young women joining her. These were the first sisters of the Company of, daughter, of the Daughters of Charity, founded when Louise was 44 years old. Saint Louise went on to build and develop 40 houses of the Company of Daughters of Charity throughout Paris and in extending throughout France. Saint Louise continued her work and direction of her sisters until the day of her death at age 68. She is canonized by Pope Pius by Pope Pius XI on in 1934. Saint Louise de Marillac, pray for us.